Hi, this is Mojo. I'm going to talk about how to join a bridge class from a Windows PC. And as always, it starts with an email for me with has, which has two links in it. I always include two links. One is the Zoom invitation and the other is the link to the bridge table. Here's the link to the Zoom invitation. When I click on that, we're, it's going to open our default browser. In my case, it's Firefox. And if you have the Zoom client installed, it's going to launch the Zoom client automatically right then. And it's going to give the option to join the video. I'll take that one. So let's join the meeting. And now we can see, of course, there are two of me now because I have uh, the Zoom meeting running on another window. And I'm going to click over here on the browser because I don't need that window anymore. And here I have my Zoom meeting. Um, all the controls are down here. I can open the chat and see if there are any messages from other students or from, from the teacher. And the other thing I can do is minimize this window. Look right up here in the right-hand corner of the window. That's Those are my magic uh, controls. This is the minimize button. This is the full screen button. And this closes the meeting. So I'm going to minimize it. And you can see that my head just turns into a little, a little window, which I can drag around the screen. And I can put wherever I want. So once again, I have my email with my special links in it. So I'm going to click on the bridge table link now so I can join uh, the bridge table at Shark Bridge. There it prompts me for my nickname. I'll put in my full name this time. What the heck? And uh, join the classroom. Now um, the teacher is going to seat me. That would be me. Let me do that. All right, now we've got a table and I've got uh, a handful of cards. Uh, while I'm here, I'd like to show you some of the features of the bridge table. Uh, first of all, the fact that Zoom is minimized means that it stays on the screen, but it's I can drag the, the video anywhere I need to so it's out of the way. And um, I wanted to show you some controls on the bridge table um, that might interest you while you're playing a game. And these are personal to you. See this little icon, the little gear icon in the upper left corner of the bridge table. If I click on that, then I have a lot of choices of things I can do. I can change the suit order or the suit colors. I particularly like um, red black myself. I'm not fond of green and orange minor suits. You can change the highlight by current player. I recommend having all three of these checked because uh, I want as many ways to see who the current player is as there can be. I want to show you some of these. These are kind of fun. Uh, if I close this, this is the standard layout for cards. If I go back to the settings and I select large scale or fan, let me do the fan first The because in, an interesting hand layout. Look how this fans the card. You might like that. I don't know. It's up to you. It's a, it's a personal choice. Uh, if I go straight and click on the large scale layout, you can see how it changes the shape of the cards. If you find this more legible and uh, easier to see what's going on, then try it out. Uh, it's worth doing either way. I'll go back to the uh, standard layout for this. And remember, these are usually saved between classes. So, uh, so that will work out. Now, oftentimes in a class, I will uh, create a breakout room so you can join a table. And right now, I'm about to assign myself to a breakout room. And here's the invitation. Uh, it, this, com this comes from Zoom, Zoom, and I'll say join. Let's see what happens. All right, it's moving me over into breakout room number one. I'm the only one here. And of course, I'm full screen now. Uh, we can't do that. We can't stay with that because I can't see the cards. But there's the minimize button right here. So I'm going to use it. I'm not going to use it. Let's see what happens if I do that. There's exit full screen, so I get out of that. Let's minimize zoom again. And there again is my little head. I can move it over to the side where I like to see it. And now I can uh, I can make bids, or North can make bids. And it's not my turn to bid, so it's not my, not my turn to play. But at some point during the session, uh, the teacher will end the breakout room, and you get this little invasive meeting in the middle. Now you can leave the breakout room now, but if you're in the middle of a, of a hand, you may want to stay here for a while and finish playing. So just X out of that uh, dialog box. And then when you actually are ready to go away, um, you can uh, get rid of the minimize zoom. You see this little button here, exit minimized video. That's good to know about because it brings back the full screen. And now I can leave the room, not the meeting, but I can leave the breakout room and I can return to the main session. 
Here I am back in the main session. You've got two views of myself. And once again, I can uh, use either speaker view or gallery view. Those are kind of fun to switch between. This is the gallery view where it shows everybody. I can minimize this. And now I can just go back to my bridge class. It always minimizes to the same place, but I can drag the video wherever I like. And once we're done, now I can I can log out of the bridge table, move my move my head over there. Yes, log out, please. Uh, I can close this window. I can uh, uh, make it not full screen. And uh, now here I can come back to the full zoom and see all the features and I can leave the meeting. And that'll be it for this. Good luck. Have, uh, have fun in bridge class.